quick little video just to show how we make our milk on board. Sometimes we're in pretty remote places <clears throat> and it's not really easy to get fresh milk. So for the last couple of years we've been doing our own nut milk every morning. Uh, Claudia does a bottle and uh, we stick it in the fridge and it lasts a couple of days. Anyway, so I get the thermo mix. I'll turn on the inverter. Actually, I'll turn it off because I like to plug in. I like to plug the um, Thermomix in first before I turn the inverter on. Then I get, the night before, I get the cashew nuts. I get like a little cup like this, quarter cup. And put the cashew nuts in a cup, fill it with water, or just a little bit of water to cover the nuts, and pour it into the Thermomix. Then I um, get a little bit more water, about half a cup. It's pretty much how much we make. By the time it's done, there'll be about a cup. Pour that into the Thermomix. Turn it on. Put the lid on. And you can do this with, uh, you see we've got cashew, you can do it with uh, cashew nuts, walnuts, uh, and you can do it with almonds as well, so you can take your choice of nuts. We do it with cashew because it tastes really good, but um, I think the walnuts are probably a little bit more healthy than the almonds. But it's a really good substitute for milk, so I'll put this on to 30 seconds, and then we'll put it on to high speed. And we'll give it 30 seconds of full speed, so it's going to get a bit noisy. So that's done. And they um, lift up the thermo mix, and there you go, fresh cashew milk. And then I'll just put that on my cereal, and my oats, and my fruit. And, um, and it's that easy, and it's really delicious. My milk on top. This is the milk. A little green container, that's where we keep the dishes. As you can see, our sink's not really that big. So we do the dishes outside. Carry a lot of dry goods on board because they last a lot longer. I think sunflower seeds, goji berries, chia, pumpkin seeds, sultanas, cashew, walnuts, and then we've got chickpeas, almonds, and then some oats, dates, cranberries, brown rice, lentils, beans, quinoa, and some turmeric powder. So plenty of dry goods and uh, lots of healthy stuff. 